Welcome, my name is Justine Gore, spiritual uh, coach and healer, teacher with a focus on empaths and HSP. So today I'm very happy to be here sharing an emotional freedom technique to help those of us that struggle with our self-esteem. So we always down on ourselves and find ourselves picking, trying to pick ourselves up off the floor when it comes to our sense of self-esteem and how we feel about ourselves, whether we can manage certain things or not. So we're going to rub our hands together. And place it on our heart. And often, especially with sort of empathy and HSP sensitivity, we can really hard on ourselves with our sensitivities. And it can sometimes get us down a bit if we're not managing our energy. We're going to do a score now between 0 and 10. 10 is like all the time I just feel rubbish. I just don't feel uncapable of anything. And zero is I've got this. Okay, give it a score and a state of witnessing and awareness. And please write it down. How able are you to manage this? How does it affect your life? Going to do a karate point chop three times, repeating with me. Even though I struggle with self esteem because of my high sensitivity, even though I struggle with self esteem because of my high sensitivity, I deeply and completely accept myself and my unique qualities. I deeply and completely accept myself and my unique qualities. Beautiful. So, two more times. Even though I struggle with self-esteem because of my high sensitivity, even though I struggle with my self-esteem because of my high sensitivity, I deeply and completely accept myself and my unique qualities. I deeply and completely accept myself and my unique qualities. Last time, even though I struggle with self-esteem because of my high sensitivity, even though I struggle with my self-esteem because of my high sensitivity, I deeply and completely accept myself and my unique qualities. I deeply and completely accept myself and my unique qualities. Eyebrow point. I feel unsure of myself. Repeat with me. I feel unsure of myself. Side of the eye. This sensitivity makes me doubt. I'm always second guessing. Never know myself. This sensitivity makes me doubt. Remember to put in your own words and see how you're actually physically feeling. Under the eye, struggling with self-esteem. How's it making you feel? I'm struggling with self-esteem. Under the nose, feeling overwhelmed by my own emotions. I'm feeling overwhelmed by my own emotions. Onto the chin, I doubt my worth. I doubt my worth. Collarbone, I have lack of confidence. I have lack of confidence. Under the arm, feeling so sensitive, I'm feeling so sensitive. Top of the head, it's hard to feel good about myself. It's really hard to feel good about myself. How true is that for you? I'm gonna do the second round now. Eyebrow, still feeling self-doubt. I'm still feeling self-doubt. Side of the eye, this sensitivity is overwhelming. This sensitivity is so overwhelming. Under the eye, I continue to struggle with self-esteem. I continue to struggle with self-esteem. What's your brain telling you? What's your mind? What's the narrative? Under the nose, feeling so affected by everything. Feeling so affected by everything. Chin, questioning my value. I question my value. Collarbone, this insecurity. Tap into it, what does it relate to? This insecurity under the arm I am so sensitive to criticism I'm so sensitive to criticism what is it do you want to please people do you feel unsafe top of the head hard to maintain confidence it's hard for me to maintain confidence okay so we're going to take a nice deep breath now breathe it out and score it how are you feeling with this journey right now in a state of witnessing and awareness between zero to 10? If you're above five, 
please go back again and repeat that script. Otherwise, we're going to move on to a new statement. Even though I have these self-esteem issues, even though I have these self-esteem issues, I'm open to recognizing my worth and embracing my sensitivity as a strength. I'm open to recognizing my worth and embracing my sensitivity as a strength. Beautiful, it's the first time. Next two times we've got, even though I have these self-esteem issues, even though I have these self-esteem issues, I'm opening, open to recognizing my worth. I'm open to recognizing my worth and embracing my sensitivity as a strength. And embracing my sensitivity as a strength. Beautiful, last time. Even though I have these self-esteem issues, even though I have these self-esteem issues, I'm open to recognizing my worth. I'm open to recognizing my worth and embracing my sensitivity as a strength and embracing my sensitivity as a strength. So we're now working through the issue, acknowledging and working through it. Eyebrow, acknowledge my worth. I acknowledge my worth. So I do the eye. I'm open to seeing my strengths. How true is this for you? I'm open to seeing my strengths. Under the eye. Exploring my positive qualities. I am exploring my positive qualities. Are you? How does this feel for you? Under the nose. Seeing my sensitivity is a gift. And it is a gift. Seeing my sensitivity as a gift. It's changing the narrative. Chin, learning to appreciate myself. Learning to appreciate myself. Collarbone, working towards self-acceptance. I'm working towards self-acceptance. Under the arm, I'm capable of feeling confident. I'm capable of feeling confident. Top of the head, I can recognise my values. I can recognise my values. Going on to the second round of tapping. Eyebrow, understanding my unique abilities. I'm beginning to understand my unique abilities. Side of the eye. I'm finding confidence in my sensitivity. I'm finding confidence in my sensitivity and that's a beautiful place to be. Under the eye, acknowledging my progress. I do acknowledge my progress. Go Again, go in the feeling senses. Under the nose, creating a positive self-image. Image. I'm creating a positive self-image. Chin. I'm growing in self-appreciation. I am growing in self-appreciation. Collarbone. Each step is building up my confidence. Each step is building up my confidence. Under the arm. Learning to love my sensitive nature. Learning to love my sensitive nature. Top of the head. I am finding my self-worth. I am finding my self-worth. Take a deep breath. And out and score it. How are you feeling with your self-esteem right now? How were the words resonating with you? Witnessing and being in a state of awareness. Above five, please repeat that step or go back to the beginning. Otherwise, we move on to a new karate point chop. And we're now moving towards a more positive self-image. So even though I face challenges with self-esteem, even though I have faced challenges with self-esteem, I now embrace my ability to love and accept myself fully. I now embrace my ability to love and accept myself fully. Recognising my sensitivity as a valuable trait. Recognising my sensitivity as a valuable trait. Do this two more times. Even though I face challenges with self-esteem, even though I face challenges with self-esteem, I now embrace my ability to love and accept myself fully. I now embrace my ability to love and accept myself fully. Recognising my sensitivity is a valuable trait. Recognising my sensitivity as a valuable trait. Beautiful. Last time. Even though I face challenges with self-esteem, even though I face challenges with self-esteem, I now embrace my ability to love and accept myself fully. I now embrace my ability to love and accept myself fully. Recognising my sensitivity as a valuable trait. 
recognising my sensitivity as a valuable trait. Eyebrow point. I am embracing self-love. I am embracing self-love. Side of the eye. I'm valuing my sensitivity. So you're turning it around. I'm valuing my sensitivity. And this should be a natural, organic experience, not false. Not pretending. Under the eye, feeling more confident. I am feeling more confident. Under the nose, I create a positive view of myself. And if this is a repeat tap, you've done it another day, you can say, I create, I'm creating a positive view of myself each and every day. Chin, I appreciate my unique qualities. I appreciate my unique qualities. Collarbone, I have the strength to feel self-assured. I have the strength to feel self-assured. Under the arm. Feeling empowered in my self-acceptance. I'm feeling empowered in my self-acceptance. Top of the head. I am successful in building self-esteem. I am successful in building self-esteem. We now go on to the second round of tapping. Eyebrow. Maintaining a positive image with ease. I am maintaining a positive self-image with ease. Side of the eye. I am confident with my unique traits. I am confident with my unique traits. Under the eye. I am worthy of self-love and respect. I am worthy of self-love and respect. Under the nose. My self-esteem is growing stronger. My self-esteem is growing stronger. Chin. Feeling balanced and self-assured. I'm feeling balanced and self-assured. Collarbone. I'm proud of who I am. I am proud of who I am. Under the arm. Embracing my whole self. Embracing my whole self. Top of the head. I have achieved a positive self-image. I have achieved a positive self-image. Taking a deep breath. And up. I choose that view. Rub your hands together. Onto the heart. How are you feeling with that? What was your journey with it? Let's score it. Zero to ten. Hopefully you're getting down towards a zero. Treating yourself with loving compassion. And if you need to repeat, please allow yourself to repeat it. Sending you love over and out.